Hello, I'm Mike Mackler. I'm the athletic director here at GCIT. With me is the female athlete of the week, Megan Garanti. Congratulations. Thank you. Megan, uh, what year are you? I'm a sophomore. And what town are you from? I'm from Washington Township. And what is your program? I'm an allied health. All right. Uh, congratulations, uh, athlete of the week. You've had a really heck of a season this year. Uh, what? Um, how long have you been playing soccer? I've been playing soccer for as long as I could, and basically as long as I remember, like my whole life. And have you played the same position? Have you played different positions? Um, I kind of switched back from defense and midfield, so now I kind of play both, like defensive mid, basically. Okay. Do you have a preference? Do you like? Uh... Um, I like the midfield. It's my favorite place to play. Well, listen. Uh, I know we've had a tough loss the other day uh, in the playoffs, but really a, a good year for the team. We're still fighting for the NJTAC championship game, uh, but you've had a great year. Uh, 19 goals, you tied the school record. That's, I don't want to say it came out of nowhere, but really, you, I would say towards uh, after the first three or four games and things really took off for the season. How did everything come about this year, you think? Yeah, well, I was playing midfield in the beginning of the season and we kind of struggled like getting up the field sometimes. So I pushed up the striker and we started like connecting the field like and I scored some goals. Okay. Wow, that's awesome. And like I said, I, I thought that the, the team had a very good year. You know, beat some really good teams. You know, came back, beat Clearview. You know, the second time, beat Williamstown. Really seems like the team like, kind of uh, got together. Yeah, I think we really played as a team towards like the end of the season. Like, we started working more as a family unit. Uh, we also have the the game at the Union Field with Defford coming up. That's got to be exciting to play in a big stadium. Yeah, it's really exciting. It was super, it was so much fun last year, and I can't wait to play this year. Okay. Um, well, best of luck in the next couple of games, and uh, you know, hopefully we get two more victories. What's one of the best things about GCIT soccer? I think one of the best things about GCIT soccer is that we all, like, we're all in a family, like, atmosphere. Like, everybody's close with one another, and, like, we all work together really well, play as a unit. Okay, awesome. What's one of the best things about GCIT? I like how everybody's so kind and, like, welcoming from, like, different schools and different places. Like, we all just come together. and. It's a great school. Like awesome, a awesome. Well, hey, congratulations. Thank you. And best of luck the rest of the season. Thank you. Female Athlete of the Week, Megan Garanti. Hello, I'm Mike Mackler, the Athletic Director here at GCIT. With me is the Male Athlete of the Week, Alan Cardano. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, what year are you? I'm a sophomore. Sophomore. Uh, what is your program? I'm in auto. Auto. And um, what town are you from? I'm from Williamstown. All right, so cross-country team really having a good year. Yeah. Second year, they, they've won the uh, NJTAC. Your times for everybody have been really good. Yeah. Um, it, it's got to be, you know, you had you know, some of the seniors that have kind of led the way, and you also have a lot of the underclassmen yeah. coming up like yourself. It's got to be an interesting mix of the team and have you guys gel together this year. Yeah, it's like a nice feel of the team, especially from, like, last season. Like, we all ran together. Uh, for a little bit closer to the end of the summer, we started running together all last season. And then this summer was real fun. We were all running together since like early June, mm -hmm. almost every day. Right, wow. Now, how long have you been running? I've been running since like sixth grade. Sixth grade, been involved in track, cross country. Yeah. Okay. Uh, running's a tough sport. It's not for everybody. It's a lot of a mental thing that, that yeah. goes along with it. So there's a lot of discipline. And like you said, just the, the off season workouts. You know, it takes a lot of uh, dedication to do that, and it seems like you've got a bunch of people that have bought into that. Yeah, sure. yeah, we had a lot of people go into it. Um, Aiden's been really, he's a really good captain. He's been getting us all together, just mm -hmm. running, just really pushing to get our times down this season. Well, uh, I know the, the TCC showcase last week, you were, what, 16.52, under yeah. 17, and yeah. Rob and everybody. That's, I mean, to get those times, that's, that's really good, and it seems like you guys are really starting to peak now. Uh, I know that... When I talked to some uh, other runners earlier, one of their goals was to make the states, and which yeah. is coming up this weekend. So it's got to be a real exciting this, for yeah. this weekend. Yeah, we're really hoping to get states this year. That's awesome. Well, I, I wish you guys the best of luck. I wish you the best of luck to, to qualify to go to states. That'd be yeah. awesome. So I uh, just want to end. What's one of the best things about GCIT? Uh, cross best country? thing about GCIT cross country is just like how close everyone is. Is like really like a family feel. Everyone's friends with it, everyone. It's just real nice. And what's one of the best things about GCIT? Best thing about GCIT is um, it's going to have to be like that you only have to take half of your classes half the year. It's the best thing. Okay, awesome. Well, hey, congratulations. Thank you. And best of luck. Male Athlete of the Week, Alan Cardano.